guys welcome back to another episode of no man's sky so today i wanted to explore that one well there's a couple planets here that i want to explore in the system but before we do that i wanted to go ahead and drop off some of this stuff at our base um actually before we do that i want to see because it's been a little while uh since yesterday so I wanted to check to see if we could trade in these two transponders, uh, pirate transponders. Because it's been a few hours, right? So, I wanted to see if it was possible or not. And it is, so we can definitely do that. I'm not sure if we unlocked any particular parts of the guild yet. No, it doesn't seem like it. Um... What are we looking at? Can't remember how to get there. Uh, where is it? Oh, maybe it was here. And Fighters Guild Mercenaries, I think. Uh, we are total level 13. Next rank in one level. So we need one more transponder in order to um, get up to the next rank. Alright, so I'm going to go to the base quickly, drop off this gold, because that's going to be really handy for um, expanding our base in a little bit. But um, there's other things in here that I want to start working on, and then we'll come back to the station and just want to make sure I know what the station name is. Uh, Gekmeyer, yeah, I called it Gekmeyer because it's a Gek system, and we're just like, yeah, we're gonna call it Gekmeyer. Just seemed appropriate. <laughs> okay, so we're going back to our base. It'll take a couple seconds to get over there, but once we're there, we can offload some stuff, and then I think I was refining some stuff earlier yesterday, so we'll see if we can't get that worked on. We also got some rusted metal that we can turn into ferrite, um, which will allow us to make other components and stuff we might need later on. I'm not sure how we're doing on ferrite, but. Alrighty then. So I'll just uh, check here. Uh, we have 30. 405 rusted metal. We have 802 gold now. Put that there. Um, don't need the ammunition on us. This can definitely go in here. That can go in here and... Thank you. 
So there's actually a couple uh, rare underground creatures on this particular planet, so I'm not sure if we're going to be able to find all of them or not, but um, I stopped over at this uh, trade station and I wanted to talk to this Gek to, just to see. Sometimes you can get some pretty good stuff from them if you get their questions right, so. Um, life form smells foul. Uh, seems like my exosuit might be... Makes me gag, okay. Uh, noticing the expression on the traders' uh, pecs at my element, they carry into pieces. Then, hmm, despair, gek trader, metal. Uh, we know about metal. Wipes, empty hands. Um, we don't have any ferrite dust. They want metal, so I'm gonna have to get some of that. Discover that creature already. Okay, so we'll see if we can't get the ferrite dust. I don't remember how much we need for it. That should be enough, I think. Okay, so we'll go ahead back to the Gak and then we'll see if we can't get whatever he's... Oh, wow. All right. Uh, give ferrite dust. Perfume. <laughs> Alrighty then. Um, while I was here, I got some of the resources from here. I got some salvage da data and some... Her her hermetic seals so uh, basically those are for a starship that I basically found not too long ago it was an explorer so we can um, fix that up which requires one of those but just quickly save this chart and then I think we'll be on our way to another location somewhere on this planet see if we can't get all the creatures on it there is quite a few that are um, underground. We have uncommon, uncommon flying, rare underground, and another rare underground always active. So, yeah, it's just going to be a little bit hard to find them, I think. But we can give it a shot. And if we don't find it today, that's. Alright, so I'm currently at this crashed freighter. Um, I thought I would explore it while we had the time and stuff. Pick up some of the resources as well. Looks like we get, um, what do you call it? Some, uh, what was it? Rusted metal and some green slime on this particular one. Sometimes they're different depending on the um, system or even the crashed freighter. So. Grab that and grab that. Okay, 
Yeah, we got some salvage data on that one. Okay, so let's see what's in this one. Hopefully we get something a little bit better. Ooh, lots of units on that one. All right, and then there is, we did that one. There's one under here. Kind of have to dig for it a little bit. I'm located, I guess, too. Where is it? There it is, it's right down there. So, we'll mine out this area. There should be a uh, area that we can mine out. Yeah, I think it's right in here. And if I remember correctly, this one you can actually just reach through the soil. So we'll put that here, put that there. Okay, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. <laughs> Alright, so there's uh, two more locations. There's one under here, and then there should be one over on that side. I did find um, one rare underground creature as well, so... We're able to do that, and I found the uncommon bird, so we just have one rare creature to find left. I have to try again. Misclicked on the uh, thing there. Alright, there we go. We got a heat capacitor. And we'll go over to the other one over here. It's a little bit of a walk, but it's just on the other side here. Uh, looks like there's a cave there, too. Might be able to find that other creature there. Who knows? Okay, so somewhere around here. There we go. Alright, so we got all the creatures on this particular planet. We can unlock what we uh, get for the nanites, which was like, I think 1,500, if I remember correctly. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look. Uh, 2,250, so a little bit more than what I was thinking. So we got all uh, nine creatures on that one. I discovered 
11 minerals and six different types of flora so got quite a bit of stuff uh, discovered on this particular planet I'm pretty happy that we found all the rare underground creatures so uh, next episode there is one more planet in the system that I'm actually curious about and that's uh, the ammonia one so there's eight creatures on this particular one so we'll probably get about 2,000 if we discover them all uh, common underground and a few different um, there's a few rare or rare ones uh, flying f rare flying and mostly flying and um, uncommon so should be a pretty easy one to collect uh, next episode so we'll definitely check that out and the cave creature is pretty common so it should be really a piece of cake to actually discover and I think there's one more planet in the system that we haven't been to and that's this one right here uh, there's 14 creatures but I haven't actually wandered around one of those kinds of planets on foot before and I know it has to do with corrupt sentinels it's fairly more recent that they added that one so we'll have to maybe check that one out at the end um, just in case it's you know not as safe to actually explore and stuff but outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe comment down below rate the video and I'll see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out